Hi, good day. Good evening. So, this is a live stream to watch before joining the fishing derby tomorrow. Hi, John and Kanishka. So, tomorrow is the start of another fishing derby. So, from the largest yellow tail to the most number of carps, this time we will be fishing for trash. What specific trash? We don't know yet. So, I've got some trash that were that appeared from the recent update so here are examples like the waste rope, waste barrel, rusty container, old submarine, leftover apple, pet bottle, trash bag, rusty anchor, ship's wheel, and I think those are the new ones. So tomorrow we will find out what specific trash we will be catching. Okay, so but here are some tips that will help you for the fishing derby tomorrow. But first, let me try to follow my alt. Okay, so if you have any questions or suggestions, please type at the chat box and I will try to answer. Alright? Other viewers can answer too. Okay, so there are two kinds of players who join the derby. First one is the grinder. The one who joins the derby on the first day. So, the earlier you join, the more probable that you need to spend a lot of time fishing for you to get your desired place because those in your team will surely be grinders too. Second one, another kind of player is the I don't want to grind but I want to win player. So, those are the ones who usually joins during the last few hours or minutes of the derby. Since you will be grouped with people, I think according to the time you join, you will be competing just among yourselves. So, there is not much difference with the grinders, except that they can flex how much they got with a larger span of time. Okay, so I used to be a grinder, but I got tired of fishing a lot. So, I just joined a few hours or minutes before the end of the derby. But if you are excited, why not? You can join the early and fish for two days. Okay, so tips before you join. Hi, mom! Do you want to follow me? I'm in East Asia. So tips before you join. Number one. Make sure to sell your common fishes and put in aquarium your most prized fishes to make space for the fishes that you will catch during the derby so this will save you time from selling your fish so for example I didn't sell my fish and I'm just here so what I will do is I will go back to the plaza and sell my fish and then if I don't have any friend available then I'll go back to that place and that place isn't that near because it's the deep sea area so, again, tip number one, sell your common fishes like this. So, I'm gonna sell my common fish to get ready for tomorrow's derby. So, there. Then, I also reminded you to put your most prized possession at the aquarium like this gonna show you my house this morning I already put my precious fishes at my aquarium so it's okay if you don't organize your aquarium just as long as you put your fish there so you will have space in your bag so as of now I will still sell some of this, but I have space already for the fishes that I will catch. Okay, so let's go out again. Number two, find a friend to fish with so you will not get bored and then you will have someone to teleport to after you sell your fish. So if you have an alt or an alternative account, go place your alt somewhere in your fishing spot. So, in my case, my alt is Birchy. I put it there at the deep sea. So, I will just follow her. 
And voila, I'm already at my fishing spot. I don't have to swim that far. If you will see, I'm very far from the shore. Okay. So number three. Get ready with your tangents. Alright, so the price that you will pay to join the derby is 10 gems so if you don't have it earn it as early as now so for me joining this event is worth it since even if you don't catch anything you will get two theme draw tickets so that's equal to spending about 50 to 60 gems for a draw but this time you can get it for just 10 gems so if you win first to third you will surely get a plaque plus at first you will get 100 gems and 10 tickets second place 75 gems 7 tickets third 50 gems and 5 tickets 4 to 10 25 gems 5 tickets i think i'm not sure about this but 11 to 50 at 15 gems 2 tickets not sure but sure sure ball you will have 1000 stars and two theme throw tickets so take the risk that will be okay then next tip next tip will be hi miss chief nice to see you here so we should to use so you should trust the stats so since tomorrow we will be fishing for trash we will use the ekorod the ekorod is the one i'm holding so this is the one with the what's that it's an earth bait so this is the echo guard fishing rod so According to the stats, it increases the success chance by 30% and trash appearance probability increased by 50%. So, since tomorrow we'll be, we will be fishing for trash, so yeah, yeah, we will be using the echo rod. So, how, we will, how will we get the echo rod? So, to get the echo rod, I'm not sure if everybody knows, but we need to go to the craft shop to craft it. So... I'm gonna show you where to craft it. So for those players who don't know, we can craft it here at the craft shop. So go here at talk to Buff J. Then go here. Then you need the following materials. You need iron ore. So just mine. It's very easy to find. Just five iron ores. One way stroke. Uh, I think this is medium sized when you fish at sea. So if you catch some rope, don't sell it yet. And then finally, the green lump fish. So you need three lump fish for you to be able to craft this. So if you are curious where to catch a certain fish, and it will also apply to the future derbies. Um, you can look here at the craft shop. It's already indicated, but you can also see it here at the illustrated book. So, for example, we're finding where the lumpfish can be caught. So, just click on it. And so, according here, it will appear at the deep sea lighthouse boat, offshore area, the resort shipwreck, deep sea area, and the time that you can catch it will be all day so even at night or day you can catch it okay so in my experience i caught this easily at the shipwreck area of the resort so to catch that easily you shall focus on the small shadows only but of course catch xl and xxl too okay so if you don't have the echo rod yet don't worry because any rod can catch trash it's just that according to the stats the echo rod can increase the probability of catching the trash by 50 percent okay so if you are wondering where the shipwreck area is it's somewhere i'm going to show you so shipwreck so you will see a broken sheep so that's where you can catch the longfish it's there ahead you can see just go at the middle and you will catch green longfish there 
and other kinds of lungfish. And then, next tip. Hello, Natal... Hello, Natella. <laughs> That's a cute pink poop. <laughs> so, next tip. Familiarize with the shadow. So, I don't memorize all the shadow sizes, but I will give you a tip. So, <laughs> Just go to the official Discord server of Play Together. I will put the link at the pinned comment so you can join. So usually PT players ask questions there and players who know the answers respond. So tomorrow, I'm sure that players will share what the size of the specific trash will be and where to find it easily. So again, here's the shape break. So this is where you can catch the longfish easily or... You can also catch it at the boats at the plaza, okay? So, if it's the old submarine, you need to go to deep sea and the shadow is... What's the shadow of the submarine? Is it XL or XXL? Somewhere between that and then the tail wiggles, okay? So, again, don't forget to fish with your friend, alright? So, follow your app. Or your friend so that you can teleport to him or her and he or she can teleport to you as well so again this is play together so we help each other <laughs> okay so good luck tomorrow hope you win the derby so I might live stream again when I join when I join so stay tuned okay so I'm not sure if I'll be joining tomorrow because I'm not sure if I will grind. Maybe I'll join on Saturday. Let's see. So thank you for watching. That's a very short live stream just to remind you of the things you need to remember for tomorrow's derby. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and turn notifications on so you will know when my next live stream will be. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye, Nutella.